So I'm coming now to the introduction to the talk. So it is well known that injection molding of thermoplastic polymer components is state of the art in production plants. Process simulation for injection molding of thermoplastic polymer components is also state of the art. There are different commercial codes on the market, several of them claiming to be the benchmark for all others. It is a dynamic market with new developments almost every year to close the still existing gap between real processing and virtual processing. Uh, artificial intelligence, machine learning, data-driven methods have entered the scene to make complex processes more efficient. With hybrid modeling approach, data from different sources can be used to feed an intelligence AI ML system. Bosch claims to become one of the leading Internet of Things companies in the world and is centralizing forces in research and development to incorporate traditional complex processes with AI ML methods. The motivation. Injection molding also plays an important role at Bosch to manufacture polymer parts. We have around 500 injection molding machines worldwide. Most polymers used are technical short glass fiber reinforced materials like nylon 66 or PPT GF30. We have high demands concerning the tolerances and we have a tendency that minimization of waste is an increasing factor. We have uh, seen that quality related process monitoring enables an automated zero defects production. We had preliminary work on process monitoring and control with partners where we showed that with the help of neural networks, it is possible to control an injection molding machine based on quality data predicted by the system and with an uh, automatic setup of input parameters on the machine according to the closed loop control. There was, however, a big disadvantage of the system. This was the enormous amount of data that has to be gathered for such neural networks on the shop floor for training and validation. We are, our hope is that simulation can overcome this drawback, this limitation to enrich the database without producing waste on the machine with a low CO2 footprint.